Hey, this is Ginger from My Sister's Scrapper. I have another project I want to share with you. Um, it's another explosion box that I created for my local scrapbook store to put on display. Um, we're going to be doing an explosion box class, and everybody gets to decide what theme they want to use. So um, I done one earlier, and it was a 4th of July paper. So for this, I used the new Bella Boulevard uh, Baby Girl paper, and this paper is really, really cute. So what I did was I um, cut this little elephant out. It was actually on a strip of the paper and um, put him on an action wobble for the lid. I thought that was really cute. And I've got some brown and some pink cardstock. All the cardstock is from American Crafts, the solid, except for the white cardstock I used at I think Basil. So here's the box. And what I did also is I fussy cut some other elephants and um, put them on some uh, scallop circles that I punched out with a punch. And there's purple and pink. And that side. And back to the front. And I added some Rick Rack trim and these really big giant uh, green buttons and I put some uh, twine from the twinery through the holes. And adhered those around. So that's the sides of the box. And then you open it up. And ta there we go. That's the box. Um, I haven't decided yet if I want to put something else here or not. I'm still debating. I probably will, but anyway. Um, I just left it pretty simple. There's a couple of journaling spots here. This one says counting our blessings, and this is another journaling spot. These were actually from the um, design paper. I just cut them out. And um, this is a strip of paper. I thought it was cute with the teddy bears. It's, it's a girl, and the little onesies on there. Then you flip it up, and I have a solid um, photo mat here. Some more little paper here, photo mat, and the cloud paper and the stripes. So then you'll whip it around, and I have um, the journaling spot here, and then on the back of this is cherry paper's darling. And then I did use some bow bunny double dot uh, solid paper right there in the yellow, and the monkeys with the little lavender plaid. I thought the monkeys were darling. And I orientated my paper so um, that way when you the photos are added, you have to spin it around. Um, so when you do put these together, you need to see how you want to add your photos. Again, um, I have the same paper that I did on the opposite side. The brown photo mat, the animal, whoops, animal paper, and the little cloud paper and the stripes. And the last one over here, this one says Counting Our Blessings. And again, this was a journaling spot from the um, design paper. The cherry paper and the bow bunny double dot, the monkeys, and the purple plaid. So there you have it. That's my little explosion box um, showing how you can create one with a baby theme. So these are great for like baby showers, bridal showers. They're really cute. Would be A bridal shower would be darling with, you know, like a girl's night out or whatever. It would be darling. Or a birthday party would be cute, would be a cute one, or a wedding. I think I might, might do a wedding one version using the Bow Bunny um, Enchanted paper. So there you have it. That's my little explosion box with the action wobble on the top. Thanks for watching. Bye.